been out detecting for about four weeks. Work and stuff like that getting in the way, so I'm on the A5, I'm on the way out to the farm. Uh, it is, what time is it? It's about 20 past nine. So, I've got about, about five hours when I get there. So, let's go and find some treasure. Oh, beautiful day. Great detecting weather. There's the old man in there. 1500s. Uh, right, I'm going to have a blast on here. It's been sort of um, roughly ploughed, but it's not too bad. Uh, plenty to go at. Keep me busy today anyway. Um, it's an old trap. The old trap runs across there. My sister says she's found loads of like Rome and medieval pots around here, so uh, don't expect to find anything from there because you never do. But um, we keep our fingers crossed, and we'll get back to you with any finds. See you in a bit. First find: nice big os shoe. That's the same around here. Okay, let's move on. All right, next one: <clears throat> about five, six inches. What's in here? I think it's a musket ball. It is indeed. Always a good sign. Okay, let's carry on. Oh, we got something out of there, and it's in here somewhere. Fairly old. I have no idea though. I'll clean that up. I'll give it a wash. Right, you want? Let's see what it is. Okay, let's move on. Right, got something in here somewhere. There it is. Another musket ball. That's about six inches. Okay, cool. Let's carry on. Right, I've got something in here. Let's see what it is. Uh. Button. Darn it. Okay. Let's move on. Well, I think I might have my first coin of the day. Possibly. It could be a button. Sounds like a button. Looks like a button. Yeah. Strange one though. I'm not sure it is a button actually. The whole thing, it's like a stud. Oh, it's a find. Let's carry on. I just took that one. Pistol ball. Uh, well, this one was nearly a surface find. There's only just in there. And, uh, First, I thought it was a thimble, but uh, don't think so. It could be the tip off a, a walking stick, a cane sort of thing. I'm not sure. Anyway, it's cool. Anyway, let's move on.
about seven inches of the musket ball. There we go, another musket ball. Fifth one today. Okay. Let's move on. Finally got a coin. About four inches. But oh dear. Look at it. Most definitely Georgian. I can't get anything off that. I'll be surprised if I can. Oh well, this one on the board of coins. Let's move on. This came out of cracking depth. That's got to be 10 inches. And it's one of those, Dave. <laughs> okay. Let's move on. Musket ball number six for the day. Who is it? I think it is, just badly formed. Okay. Uh, right, I've got a signal here. Another one. It's like Dumbarton for sure this. Okay, let's move on. Guess what? Musketball. There we go, we've got a surface find. Just sitting there. Let's see what it is. Okay, let's move on. Right, about um, five inches down. say seventeenth century sixteenth seventeenth century small little buckle beauty okay let's move on Bad boy. The 
size that against my finger. That's big, that is. That could possibly be um, what they call a grape shot. So let's put like a hundred of these in a cannon and shoot, a bit like the principle of a, a modern shotgun. Cause some damage. Okay, cool. Okay, got something in here. Oh, that's nice. Playing back, pattern front, that's a token. Seventeenth, 18th century. Nice find. Okay, let's move on. Basketball. Yet another. All right, this one. I'll be excited. Uh, it's about five inches down, and I think I've got something good. I'll even top me glove off. That's hammered. Come on, get in. Oh. Oh, come on. Yeah, small. Oh, I don't want to rub it. Is that what's it say on there? I don't know. I've been told not to rub them by Mr. Ian Hughes. I got told off. Uh, so, oh, that side doesn't look too good. Um, no, I'll clean it up in the, uh, in the review later. But that, it doesn't look early hammered. like a later hammered to me. But get in. Come on. You beauty. Oh. Get in. I got a signal in here and it's shallow. <laughs> I know what this is. Loads of these. <laughs> ah. A snuff box. A snuff tin. <laughs> okay, let's move on. I've lost count there. Is that 10 or 11? I can't remember. Okay, got another coin. It's only about five inches down. Looks like a crusty old Georgian. be a half penny from somewhere around the mid half of the 1700s I would have thought okay let's carry on okay there's something in here Georgian, I think, with farthing. Look at the size, it's 
to the coin I suppose. Cool. Right, there's something in here. George, I can see something on that one. And that's going to be really late 1700s. Last one. Okay, let's move on. Okay, I've got something, I'm not sure if it's a coin. That's uh, a big old button. That's a big button. Okay, let's move on. Well, I just took this. I'm not sure if it's a button or a really small trade token. Look at that shank on the back. I can't see any signs of it, but it's so small. Cool. Let's move on. Well, that gave a good signal. Good 10 inches, that. Creepy cock lead. Must have had some use, but... Some kind of weight? No idea. I guess it's some kind of weight. Okay, let's move on. Well, that's it for me today. I'm tired now. Dug a lot of stuff. Uh, thanks for watching, subscribing, commenting. Appreciate that you do. Uh, and uh, we'll see you all next time. Cheers, mate.